YouTube, hello once again. We're back with a tutorial. It's Sal here again, your host. Uh, in this video, we're going to be um, installing AirPrint so you can print from your iPod, iPhone, uh, iPad devices to your Windows shared printers. Alright, so before I begin, love me or hate me, please subscribe to my channel. Not only do you, uh, not only do you need to subscribe to subscribe to my channel, you want to subscribe to my channel. So, click <laughs> click subscribe right now, and I'm gonna get on with this. So, in order to begin, you need a small tool called the AirPrint Activator. I downloaded, and um, I'll have the notes. Uh, I'll have the link to the to the uh, zip file uh, in my blog description. I also have a, a blog post linking to this uh, video. So what you got to do, you download, it's a zip file. So you open the zip file as we see here. And uh, I'm going to try and zoom in here. Uh, this is digital zoom on my uh, f my uh, flip, fo flip uh, camera here. And there's an executable file, airprintactivator.exe. I just dragged it to the desktop, desktop as you've just seen. So here it is. I'm going to run it here. Just uh, actually, I'm going to right click and run as admi as an administrator. Okay. Now here it's asking permission. You say yes. Now it's in German. So I believe what it says is step one is to, um, I guess, install or activate one of these two clicks. So here. If you have a 32-bit operating system, you would click the first link. If you have a 64-bit operating system, you'd click a second link. I I am uh, running Windows 7 64-bit, so I'm going to be clicking the uh, second button. Now, I believe step two is telling you that you have to share your printer. So when you mine is already being shared, so hopefully you won't need any help. But it's in the go to control panel printers, and it's in there where you got to share it, I believe. And then step three, uh, make sure the firewall has access, the uh, air print has access through your Windows firewall. All right, so let's begin. Here I go. I'm going to activate air print. I just clicked it. And there's a message. It says done. As you can see there. So we're going to click yes. Okay, guys, here is where we're going to test the printing. From your, from your, uh, for in my case, it's going to be from my iPhone. So we're going to go print, and printer is there. Print, sending to printer. And I don't know if you can hear it. And there it comes. Here's the email I printed. So I gotta check the color of my thing. But uh, it works, guys. There you go. There's the email. So uh, hopefully uh, you can get this working for you. Uh, it's very simple to do. Couple steps. Uh, so um, good luck. Hey guys, uh, this is just a little special addition to the video. It's uh, just a quick recap. Okay, so you download the AirPrint Activator, you uh, install it, select if you want Win32 or the Win64 bit version, depending on what operating system of Windows you have. I am using Windows 7. I don't know if this will work with XP or Vista. Should work with Vista. I don't see uh, why it shouldn't, but give it a try. Uh, I don't have an answer to it, but um, hopefully, uh, hopefully it just works. After, make sure you uh, share your printer, okay, from the from your computer. Uh, make sure the guest account in your uh, Windows computer is turned on, because when you print for the first time, it's going to ask you for a username and password, 
and the username is going to be guest with a blank password okay so make sure you see here my guest account don't know if you can see it here but that is my guest account right here and it's uh, it's turned on okay and you're gonna need that on to print so once it's once it's done you install you share you turn your guest account on you're ready to print good luck once again and uh, I'll see you in the next video ciao for now